Welcome back in the Open Wet Lab of Wax Society. Today we're going to look for antibiotics in plants. Plants are really great resources of uh, compounds. They're full of it. And you know that because plants are already used in traditional medicine for centuries. But today we're going to look for a specific uh, compound, antibiotics. And uh, we're going to show you how that's done using an extraction protocol. You need a couple of things. First of all, some equipment. Uh, I brought a hot plate and also a water bath and a cutting board with a knife. Of course, you also need a plant. This is an orchid. It's a red one here from the market. Uh, I ch chose it because it has a lot of flowers and of course it's blossoming. So it looks nice, but not for long because we're going to cut it up in pieces. Next, we also need uh, the alcohol to do the extraction and a filter. Okay, we're going to start with the plant, the orchid. We need a few flowers, so we're going to pick two. One, like this, and another one. So the compounds that we're looking for are inside the leaves, so we need to chop them up in pieces. Just use a regular knife and chop them up a couple of times. The smaller you can make the pieces, the better. It's like cutting an onion or a garlic. All right, so the leaves are cut in pieces, and I'm going to put all of them in this tube. first step is done and it's called officially size reduction, just cutting things in pieces. The next step is to do extraction. Um, I've got some 96% uh, alcohol here. It's an organic solvent. It will do the job. If you use two leaves, I would say, well, pour in 20 milliliters. Hmm, 25, it's also okay. Close the tube, shake a couple of times. You can also place the tube in a water bath for two hours to really do the extraction well. The tube has been in the water for a couple hours and now, yeah, you can see that the liquid changed color. Many of the compounds are now in the liquid. But of course you want to get rid of all the small parts of the leaves. And for that we'll use a coffee filter. You can fold it a couple of times so that it fits well into a funnel on top of a Erlenmeyer glass. So just put the filter in there and pour the liquid into the filter. So there it goes. You can see this is clear yellow liquid coming out. This is the alcohol full with the compounds of the, of the plant. All right. So now we have about 25 milliliters, maybe 20 left, but still that's really a lot. And we want to concentrate this, this a little bit more. So for that, I'll put the, the glass on a hot plate and heat it up for a moment. I think this is gonna take about five minutes. Uh, you have to watch the liquid closely. You don't want uh, the compounds to burn inside. There has to be a little bit of liquid, liquid left at the end of the step. Yeah, I think, it's, I think we're there. It's a little bit of liquid left and uh, some of it is already stuck to the side. It's a bit of a pity. So we can try to suck it out with the, with the pipette. There it goes. <laughs> Take off my glove and place it in the Eppendorf tube. All right, this is it. This is our liquid gold, our potential antibiotics. We've extracted it from, from a plant and it's now in this tube. We don't know yet if it works, but we have to test it. And that's why we made the next video. Check it out.